Hello everyone. This is Fine from Awesome Tech Even Pro. I hope you all are well. NVIDIA GeForce RTX 4080 16 GB 3D Mark benchmark leaks out and it's up to 62% faster than RTX 3080. The NVIDIA GeForce RTX 4080 16 GB graphics card was up spotted over at Chief Health Forums and based on the data provided. It posted a score of 28,929 points within the 3D Mark times by benchmark. It should always be pointed that the graphics card was running at GPU clock speed of up to 3000 megahertz, which is a 490 plus megahertz increase over the listed boost clock of uh, 2510 megahertz of the 16 GB variant. I can't say for sure if this is an overclocked variant or if it is running at stock clocks. One can also make the graphics card run at higher clock simply by raising the power limits. The graphics card is seen running at a TDP of 333 watt while the TGP is rated at 290 watt. This is within the 320 watt specifications that all reference variants should offer. The GDDR6X memory is operating at 22.4 gigabyte per second, so it looks like the memory clock was not touched. In terms of performance, the graphics card scored 28,929 points, which marks a 32% increase over the RTX 3090 Ti and a 62% increase over the RTX 3080 10 gigabyte graphics card. The card also pushes up to 57% higher performance than the 12 gigabyte RTX 3080. I also saw several 3D mark benchmarks from the same leaker yesterday, so it sum it all up. The NVIDIA GeForce RTX 4080 16 GB graphics card is expected to utilize a cut down 8103 300 GPU configuration with 9728 cores of 76 SMs enabled of the total 84 units, whereas the previous configuration offered 80 SMs or 10240 cores, while the full GPU comes packed with 64 megabyte of L2 cache and up to 2024 ROPs. The RTX 4080 might end up with 48 megabyte of L2 cache and lower ROPs too due to its cut down design. The card is expected to be based on the PG136 by 139 SKU 360 PCB. The graphics card is said to offer a peak clock rate of 25,000 plus megahertz. As for memory specifications, the GeForce RTX 4080 is expected to rock 16GB GDDR6X capacities that are said to be adjusted at 22.5GB per second speeds across a 256-bit bus interface. This will provide up to 720GB per second of bandwidth. This is still a tad bit slower than the 760GB per second bandwidth offered by the RTX 3080 since it comes with a 320-bit interface but a lowly 10 gigabyte capacity to compensate for the lower bandwidth. NVIDIA could be integrating a next-gen memory compression suit to make up for the 256-bit interface. The card will have a TDP of 320 watt, which is 30 watt lower than the TDP of 12 gigabyte RTX 3080 and much lower than the TDP of RTX 3090 Ti, while offering a big, big performance jump. The NVIDIA GeForce RTX 4080 16 GB and RTX 4080 12 GB graphics cards will be launching in November and be priced at 1200 US dollar and 900 US dollar respectively. Considering if the card does end up around 20 to 30 percent faster in games than RTX 3090 Ti, then it could say that RTX 4080 will be very good for gamers. So that's it from now. If you like this video, please subscribe and press the bell icon for future notifications update. Thanks for watching.